Hello students, today we shall discuss question number 12 of exercise 2.4. Verify that x cube plus y cube plus z cube minus 3xyz equals to 1 by 2 x plus y plus z into x minus y whole squared plus y minus z whole squared plus z minus x the whole squared. This is a very important question and there is like a 90% chance that you will get this question on your test. However, this is very easy to solve. We start from the right hand side. All we need to do is prove that the left hand side is equal to right hand side. So we will start from the right hand side. RHS is 1 half into x plus y plus z. I'm just writing this part into x minus y the whole squared plus y minus z the whole squared plus z minus x the whole squared. Okay. Now we know that x minus y squared we can use the identity a minus b the whole squared which is a squared plus b squared minus 2ab or you can write it as a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. Okay. This is the identity that we will use equals to 1 by 2 into x plus y plus z and then we will open up the brackets so x squared plus y squared minus 2xy using this identity plus y minus z the whole squared y squared plus z squared minus 2yz plus now we will open up the last bracket so that's z squared plus x squared minus 2zx equals to 1 by 2 into x plus y plus z and we will see like terms x squared x squared combine so that's 2x squared y squared y squared plus 2y squared z squared z squared plus 2z squared and then minus 2xy minus 2yz minus 2zx minus 2xy minus 2yz minus 2zx next step 1 by 2 x plus y plus z now if you see here each of these terms has 2 2, 2, 2, 2, 2, 2. So we can take 2 as a common factor outside the bracket and then the rest we will write. So 2 I have taken here x squared plus y squared plus z squared minus xy minus yz minus zx. Now here there is a 2 and 2. So 2 and 2 cancels out. Right? So what is left? x plus y plus z into x squared plus y squared plus z squared minus xy minus yz minus zx and this is the identity which is given in your textbook as identity 8 so this is equal to x cubed plus y cubed plus z cubed minus 3xyz right this is the identity which is already given to us and this is what this is equal to our left hand side see here x cube plus y cube plus z cube minus 3 x y z so that equals to the right hand side equals to right hand side so we can say left hand side is equal to right hand side hence we have verified that hence very I hope this is clear to all. Still, if you have any doubt, you can put it in the chat box. Thank you.